Hey guys, thanks for stopping by the channel. I'm not going to beat around the bush. I'm going to jump in here. Youth being the title, God of War Ragnarok, Feast Two Requirements. And one quick notation at the bottom before we get started native resolution, no upscaling employed uh, for these requirements. I feel like 1080p 60s, where we're going to start off with, because a lot of you are like, if I'm going to play it, I at least want to play it 60 frames a second at 1080p. So on the GPU side, you're going to need an RTX 2060 Super or a Radeon RX 5700. Let me jump down and look at the install size, guys. 190 gigabytes of SSD required. Yeah, she's a big one. Okay, and uh, for the CPU, Ryzen 5 3600, really no surprise there. Uh, the Intel i5 8600. Now, quickly, we'll go back down to 1080p 30. Now, that is low settings. You're looking at a 1060 or 5500 XD from Tim Radeon. Or on the CPU side, we have a 4670K or the Ryzen 3 1200. Again, you can get by with 8 gigabytes of system RAM instead of 16. All right. Moving right along to 1440p 60. Well, I know a lot of you are like, that's my spot. I want 1440p 60. This is with high settings. You're going to need an NVIDIA RTX 3070 or from Team Radeon, an RX 6800. Both great GPUs still alive and kicking in 2024. And on the CPU side, they're calling for a i7 7700K KB Lake or a Ryzen 7 2700X. A little bit of an interesting pairing there. Uh, again, 16 gigabytes of system RAM. Uh, that will carry through the rest of the chart. Now, 4K60, they jumped right up to 4K60 high settings. We didn't have a 4K30, so we're jumping right into 4K60. Sounds good to me. You will need an RTX 3080 Ti, or in Radeon RX 6900 XT. Two pretty heavy hitting GPUs, guys. If you're gonna wanna play this at high settings at 4K 60 native resolution, uh, you're gonna need a little bit of a heavy duty punching power. Uh, but you know what? I bet it will look amazing and will play really great. Fingers crossed on that. On the CPU side, we're still the i7 7700K carried over from the 1440p 60 segment. Ryzen 2700X again carrying over as well. Uh, now, to wrap this up, the 4K60 average ultra settings. And so we're cranking up the detail and the GPU horsepower. So you will need a 4070 Ti from NVIDIA. And from Team Radeon, the RX 7900 XT, uh, is what they're saying will get the job done at 4K 60 Ultra settings. And on the CPU side, i5 11600K. So a Rocket Lake uh, CPU is making an appearance alongside a Zen 2 3700X. And so, you know, the game is, it looks amazing, guys. I, I'm really excited to play the game. A uh, little bit of a personal hang-up for me is that I'm not fond of Sony requiring the PlayStation account integration. I maybe can give them a little bit of wiggle room for that online game that came out not long ago for the online segment. But a single-player game, forced account integration, I'm not the biggest fan, guys. Let me know what you think about that down in the comments section. And uh, yeah, this is John of War Ragnarok, Peace to Requirements. I'm signing off.